Jack, well done. How do you assess the performance today? I was delighted with the players. This this competition has been challenging for us because we've had to use utilise the whole squad to come to come through the group with maximum points. is um, is testament to the whole group. And today, I thought we were good. We um, created a lot. I think the the danger when you don't capitalise on those opportunities and extend your lead is that it only takes. Um, a little 10-15 minute spell in the game to swing in the favour of the opposition. I think Dundee were enjoying a good spell and equalised, but again, the response for us was good um, in terms of the opportunities we created thereafter. The difference was that obviously we were ruthless then as well. Does that really show the depth of this squad, that the likes of Melker and, and Jamie can come off the bench and, and have a real impact? I think Melker was on the pitch for less than 60 seconds. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's some good players here that have had limited game time. You know, I think until recently we had used the, f the fewest players in the Premiership in terms of a league matches, and that was, that's because we've been playing well and, and individually players have been performing well. So when you have a little bit of a dip in results and in, in performances, it allows opens up opportunities potentially. And, and all those players that, that had those opportunities today, whether it was starting or coming off the bench, I think did their utmost to try and make the most of them, and, and that's encouraging for me. Do you learn plenty about the character of your team, perhaps, in moments like that when they've, they've dominated but maybe not got the second goal and then had the setback? And, and we were wondering whether the, the tide had turned and maybe it was in Dundee's favour at that stage, but they certainly blew that out of the water. I think it's something that we've got better at. Um, I think it's something we still need to keep improving as a club in terms of, you speak about mentality a lot and about the culture and where we, where we see ourselves and how we get there. And, but when you do concede, I think to have the the fortitude to to grab a hold of the game again, as I said, and be brave enough going forward to create the opportunities we did shows where the players are at mentally. You know, as I said, they've had this recent blip, if you like, but over the, the course of the last few months, they've shown that they're resilient, but they're also talented, and um, that's encouraging for me. Yeah, you talked about it being a, a bumpy couple of weeks. How mm. important, therefore, was it to get a victory and, and a very clean victory at that? Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't have been defining for us, but but equally, whenever you lose matches or you suffer disappointments, it's human nature to, to take a little bit of a dent to confidence or trust in what you're doing. And um, It's all right talking about it in the confines of the changing room, but out on the pitch is where it matters. 